All right, guys, it has been a minute since the last guide. Um, I'm going to be coming out with quite a few in the next coming days. Maybe even just throw out them all today and just let you guys go crazy on them. Um, but for today's guide, we're going to be talking about... Get this motherfucker in position. So we're going to be talking about um, after Demon Godfist and after Side Beat, we're going to be talking about how to move the opponent farther or closer away the platforms so that we can abuse the platform or abuse them not being able to go to the platform so a lot of problems that people have is you know you'll hit an electric chair and they can di left and you would have had to go like this or you'll go here and they go to the platform and then you have to guess kind of like, it's like a 50 50 on which one you want to do so there are some scenarios where we can bypass that if we just move them farther or further away or closer to the platform or further away from the platform so like for instance Let's say I'm right here. Um, if I were to do a uh, demon got this, boom, they can go right. They won't go to the platform, or they can go left and they'll go to the platform like she did. So to bypass that, we can do a CDC before we go into a stature smash like this. So we can buffer a CDC, and it'll move them really far away. We get a lot of distance here, and then boom, look, look where she can go. No platform in sight right there. So, um, and you can also use this, let's say, for like, for instance, right here. To make it so that they can only go to the platform. And basically, I'm just doing CDC after Demon Gothis. And I'm buffering it. And then I'm canceling it with a forward. So, sorry, let me run, run this back. So, Demon Gothis, obviously. I'm buffering a CDC with... The normal stick not the c stick because the c stick you're gonna have to do tight timing and you're going to probably miss input a lot unless you get like the timing perfectly down i guess i'm doing it here but you're not gonna be able to do it frame perfectly okay so that's like a problem and that's a miss input that we might get so we don't really want to do that so this and then basically just do the electric input with the stick don't don't think don't think of it as the crouch dash input just think of it as the electric input and um then you're going to have to cancel it with the forward input which means after you do the cdc you'll be running like this so if you're practicing it you'll get this right here um and then after the forward cancel input you just go into the stature smash using the c stick so down back so boom forward cancel input into the down back on the c stick and it should look like this and this doesn't give her an opportunity to go anywhere but the platform so at least from this distance here and we're, we can abuse that we can abuse that so this is like this is some stuff this is like some like this is like i don't even know this is like an optimization that could have been done a long time ago but no one really does it and i have never seen anyone do it so i might as well just put it out here for people to start doing because i started doing it recently just because i realized that like we could do it and it just makes sense like every it just makes sense to do this you know what i mean so this is a slight optimization for Kazuya, and right there I missed it a little bit, so I need to go farther. Here. Look at all that distance. That's so far. I'm mid-stage when I'm starting it, and there's nowhere to go. Guaranteed to go to the platform. Okay, and then if we want to reset and we want to go over here, um, I'll show this as well. Basically, right now, she can go to the platform. But if I electric and she DIs straight right, she'll be able to go to the right side of the platform. And we don't really want that, because then it's a 50-50. So I hit a Demon Godfist here. I CDC into this. Into the forward cancel stature smash, and then boom. Okay. So, one more time. She can't DI to that platform. Look at all that extra damage we got. This is uh, basically, in theory, going to help eliminate some of the 50-50s that we get uh, in the middle of the stage or under platforms and stuff after Demon Gothis and Side Beat. Alright, so if you guys have any questions on how to do this or if you want any further like uh, help, just go in the comment section and I will respond to comments and stuff like that and I will get to you guys. I'll respond to every single comment in this video. So just let that be known, and yeah, I'll see you in the next guide. Peace.